Alrighty, I have a really cool update for you guys today. I caught so much on the camera and we have a lot to talk about because two rides have been completed officially at Canada's Wonderland. So Snoopy's Racing Railway and Tundra Twister are complete. Right now in front of you, they were getting the bat trains loaded onto the track. So I thought that was really cool. As you can see here, Snoopy's Racing Railway's track is fully complete. They're now working on the foundation for that second, second launch shed. Uh, you won't stop in there. You're just going to pass right on through. I highly advise checking out Grace Peacock on um, Toronto Star and CTV. Uh, great shots of Tundra Twister and Snoopy's Racing Railway. Honestly, the coaster looks so good, especially where Grace was standing. It's such an iconic shot. Um, but nonetheless, lots of work going on on Timberwolf Falls. So what they are doing, I can confirm this, is completely refurbishing the concrete in Timberwolf Falls. Um, so that's really cool. You're going to see Tundra Twister progress through this video. So this was filmed at around 11 a.m. As you can see, the gondolas are not on. They're sitting down there. Uh, and this digger is digging out where uh, the op booth will go and the elevator will go and the queue line will go. By the end of the video, they're ready to pour um, cement or sorry, concrete, down. They're moving real quick on this ride. So their goal is to have it ready for opening day. I don't know. Their training weekend was supposed to be this weekend, um, and it's definitely not happening this weekend. Here they are at front gate getting ready. They're digging up that grass and concrete area there to a double almost the uh, capacity of front gate with this temporary fix to allow more guests to enter the park. Love that they're doing this. Hate it at the same time, too, because it means that we're not going to get a front gate reno anytime soon. But nonetheless, anything, anytime Wonderland takes a step in the right direction for better capacity, I'm going to applaud them. Here we are at around 12.30 p.m. Um, the first gondola was being attached. That was really cool. So this happened at about 1.30 p.m. And then I believe the fire happened. And then I kept filming after that. So here they are cleaning out Whitewater Canyon before they fill it. So they're going to get all the leaves and debris out of there. Uh, so this is them doing that. Thought that was really cool because I had never seen that before. Um, again, I saw, I saw a lot today. It was really cool. I, 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 I hope everyone finds it cool. I, but I was like, I was, I was highly entertained. Are you not entertained? Um, but here's Vortex's paint job in the sun looking vibrant as F. Like it looks good. Like I love it. Like now that I see it on a bright sunny day, I'm like, yes, Wonderland. Yes. Um, but here we are, Tundra Twister with two gondolas. So this was filmed at exactly 3 p.m. Because I remember, I looked at the time, 3 p.m. Okay, send the drone up. Um, so here it is, two gondolas attached um, on Tundra Twister. I, they did not unravel it. Unravel it? Yes, is that the right word? Yes, it's the right word. I think so. Tear me apart in the comment section if it isn't. But um, there we are. And as you can see, off to the left is where the queue line is going to go, where that digger currently is moving. That is where the queue line is. As you can see, as they progress, so this is around 3.30 p.m., I believe. Uh, a lot of flattening. And um, then you're going to see gravel, I think. The last shot, I think, at around 4 p.m. when I flew, um, they put some of that gravel down where they then can pour concrete on top of it. But yeah, they made really quick progress now. Like, it's so funny. Wonderland, like, I don't know what it is. It's obviously weather related. It has to be weather related. You know, when there's still snow on the ground and it's winter, it's like so slow, slow moving, blah, blah, blah. And then as soon as the weather gets warm, you're like, there's no way this is going to be done anytime soon. It's like, bam, 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 and done. So I, I just like, it's, I have that saying now. Wonderland just has a way of pulling through. So, um, yeah, this is the, the 4 p.m. shot of Front Gate. So after they had ripped up all the grass up there um, and concrete. I'm super excited to see how that helps, you know, alleviate crowds at the Front Gate and those long lines. Um, and, yeah, I know Wonderland's had a really successful year with hiring. So I do suspect that they might use those pretty frequently on the weekends. Um, obviously, they're not going to be in use on weekdays uh, to start. But yeah, here we go. Here they are getting that, you know, you can see they put that, they put the dirt down. You see that like brown. They put the dirt down and they flatten it. And then they start putting this cement gravel 
on top of that. So here they are. They're making really quick work on the paint job as well. Again, it's looking really good. Um, here's a better shot of it. See how much they've done? See that? Wow. That sounds so unenthusiastic, but I mean it. Like, wow. Um, but yeah, here it is by the end of the day. Um, obviously, I forgot a shot. Maybe I'll upload a picture. Because there is a picture where it shows the gravel down. So I'm, that's why I was just looking at it a little confused. You can see where the platform to get onto the platform is going to go. You can see the little uh, rebar cage coming out of the ground. I don't know if that's going to be the elevator, the op booth, or the boarding staircase to get up there. Um, but nonetheless, you can see the rebar cage for that. Um, I don't know exactly where the op booth is going to go. Um, but I do see the possibility. There's a rebar cage way in the back by the far back left support column that could be where the op booth goes as well so and that's where the electrical led to so that would make sense anyways thanks so much for watching today's update i wasn't expecting to talk through the whole thing so i'm highly impressed i don't even feel like i uh, repeated too much information but nonetheless i really appreciate it guys you guys have been leaving like some of the nicest comments ever in the comment section about these updates so i'm really happy that you're enjoying them so i just want to take time to say thank you have a good one guys bye